coming up, what's the craziest thing y'all did in 2022? 2022, I think the craziest thing I did was a six sum. Six sum? So how many guys, how many girls? Uh, four, four guys. guys and, and me and her. Wow, y'all are some exotic shit out here. Okay, with that being said, what's something you want to get off y'all bucket list in 2023? A seven sum. Yo, check this out. I look at it like this, fellas. As the years progress, the body counts for these women. For certain men, I'm not gonna say all men, because some of you men out here don't know how to um, actually will in the sex, will in these women. So for certain men, the body counts will always rack up, and for these women, especially those who are single. And the reason why they will rack up is because we're dealing with a liberal society. Free sex, free speech, um, well, to a certain extent, or you'll be canceled. We know that, right? Uh, depends on who you are. You know, marijuana, uh, everything's open, vaping, everything's just kind of like open for those to be who they want to be and do the things they want to do without being shamed, without being held accountable. <clears throat> You know, marginalized ridicule and things of that nature. But it also depends on who you are, fellas. Y'all already know I can't do the intro. I'm about to start driving. Oh, yeah, I'm about to head up out of here, man. Go take care of some business. You know, get some things jumping, you know what I'm saying? Just leaving the gym. Just pulling up from the damn gym. Actually, you can see my bag still over here. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, just leaving the gym. I gotta go get my hair lined up. But uh, like, share, and subscribe hit the notification bell, fellas. Like, share, and subscribe hit the notification bell. Go to the description up under my videos. You know how to get at me. Everything's there. Holler at me. Patreon, social media, uh, platforms, the cash app. You can support the channel. Yeah, everything's there. You know, Gmail, phone number so you can hit me up for a consultation. Or if you got any emergency, if anything's going on, I'll let me, man. I can help you through it. At least I'm going to try. I'll give you my best ability. Can't make you a promise, man, like the rest of these motherfuckers out here. Tell you some shit, lead you up, lead you down that rabbit hole, or lead you, you know, you get led astray. My video for education purposes only fair use only. Let's talk about it. And good looking out for the, to the subscriber for sending me this. Uh, uh, my dude Mike, show me Big Mike, Big Mike, send me this, yeah, it's a subscriber I got, man, he pretty cool, but what do you want to ask me, Big Mike, what do you want, you ask me, uh, what do I think about this video, how do I think, um, uh, about couples coming together in the future, will it ever, um, remain, will it ever, you know, stay in place or will it just go astray to where it's not going to be there anymore? It's just like it'll be free fall or whatever, you know, everybody's fucking with, you know, what Mac Mall say, if y'all don't know if y'all know everybody's fucking everybody, let's get a telly and don't tell nobody. Y'all don't know if y'all remember that Bay Area shit back in the days at uh, Underground Music from Mac Mall, but uh, I see it. Once again, fellas, we're liberal. We're we're in a liberal time era. We're in a liberal society, and I'm not gonna say across the world because certain countries dictate, you know, dictate and um, actually um, stand on, or should I say, um, let me see, their policies and things are like mm, written. I mean, it's etched in stone to where it's within their constitution. Not to be more so like America or something. You got some countries like that, like if I'm saying it right. You know, due to their religion. I mean, race. Uh, certain, I mean, gender. I mean, whatever it is, um, social status. Whatever it is that got them not being like America, it is what it is. And I, I don't know. <clears throat> But then you got some countries that's like America. It's more so on the um, free fall, 
you know, do what you do and have fun. Don't be shamed. And, you know, if ever you get shamed and you know what it is, we come together and cancel you out. <clears throat> so by it being like this, fellas, women are going to gravitate to their freedom more so than men. That's why you see a lot of men wanting these relationships and want to get married, maintain the, uh, um, the marriage and um, try to maintain the household with the family structure and things of that nature. And you got women out here not really caring for that because we're dealing in a different era, fellas. And um, I guess if you were family orientated or if you were that monogamous guy, this ain't going to work for you. It's like you're forced to be outside of who you really are. But at the same time, you're not forced to be outside of who you really are. What it is is displaying and it's putting a mirror up to us men to um, actually be a man instead of being led by women, instead of being guided by women, instead of bending over backwards, doing what the fuck they want you to do when you, you have no balls type shit. You know what I'm saying? So by you being a man, then they, they can't do nothing but submit to your program. Or get the fuck out of here. That's real talk. And if you guys are these type of guys who can't uh, put your foot down and stand on your shit, actually, um, um, let me see, apply pressure within your wordplay. Uh, I mean, not wordplay, but within your words to the woman. And I'm not talking about violently or coming at her um uh, you know, um, you know, just being derogative and things of that nature. No, we're not talking about that. I'm talking about actually telling her, hey, if you don't meet these requirements, then I'm going to have to let you go and bring in some more chicks and things of that nature. You got to get the fuck out of here and stand on your shit. You know, and a lot of women will respect you. And not only say these things, you demonstrate these things to her. You demonstrate who the fuck you are and um, what you're not going to put up with and, and um, what you're about. You got to demonstrate to her. If you don't demonstrate these things to women, they're going to automatically take you as weak. Why? It's because so many men out here has been taken as weak because they are weak. They are not demonstrating themselves to these women in a masculine and macho type way to um, actually um, putting themselves first, you know, just put it like that. A lot of guys are not doing that. And so by them not doing it, it opens up the floodgate for these women to do what the fuck they want to do. And when they do what the fuck they want to do, this is what you get. She said she just had a six on right year 2023. Her new year's, um, uh, <clears throat> resolution is to have a seven, some eight, some nine, some, and just keep on going with it, you know? However, the thing is this. I'm not here to judge her. She can do her thing. Just count me in, baby. I'll knock your motherfucking throat out of pocket. You back out. I, I ain't no watch shit. I give it to you how you want it. I don't give a fuck. Just count me in and fuck with me. That's my thing. Now, judging you for your bodies and, you know, for your body count and things of that. Now, you, you got a lot of guys. Oh, and I know they going to hit me with this, man, KC, man. I don't know why you don't see it. Ain't nothing. I don't know why you... See, that it's cool to fuck with a woman that rack up bodies and a woman that just, you know, giving her pussy out like that, you know. I mean, she had no soul. She can't soul tie with you. What they what else they say? Fuck. Parabon. She can't <laughs> she can't parabon. She won't do nothing. You crazy as a motherfucker. If you that motherfucker she's feeling and she's liking and she's actually sexually attracted to, and she can see herself being led by you. Shit, I bet you she a pair of bond with you real fast. And she took a thousand dicks. Real talk, man. You know, everybody play within their lifetime. You know, we all got time to play, especially when we're young. They, they seem young, so they, that's how they play. They having their fun. I didn't have my fun. I played, and I'm still playing at 41. So, fellas, you can't stop them from wanting to do what they want to do. Play, you know, run around and, you know, play games on suckers and simps, you know, and um, get ran through by the alphas and the big dogs, motherfuckers who actually standing on shit. 
That's that's what it is, fellas. You know, that's what it is. That's life. Them having fun and them um actually um getting out there and putting themselves in the company of a lot of men. Hey, some of them are getting that pussy ate up, carpet munched by women. They doing their thing. They having fun. And then later on, they're going to want to get settled down with. They're going to want to be taken care of. They're going to want to be um, supported, secured, and things of that nature. And guess what? There's going to be a motherfucker there to do that. Right? Of course. We know that. So why trip on their body counts? Why trip on them fucking this dude, that dude, this I mean, that's their life. That's what they want to do. All these women get down like that, fellas. Yeah, you got some that's got a bare minimum of bodies up under their belt. And, you know, they're out there, but they got bodies. What Chris Rock say, it's too much for you, right? You couldn't take it if you tripping on who she's laying with, you know? How motherfucking stretching that ass, stressing that ass, I mean, stretching that ass out and doing their thing. You tossing and turning in the bed, knowing that the motherfucker doing this or have done this to your woman, doing the same things you done. Why? It's because she's a woman, man. These are women. They made to get that motherfucking pipe. Just like you made to give it to them. And none of us made to complain about sex. Because sex is normal and it's natural and it's a part of us. As human beings, you must understand that. Get that shit out your motherfucking head. Man up, quit being suckers. Like these videos, share them, and subscribe, body count men. And come over here and fuck with this channel because you definitely need it. Get out your goddamn feelings and know that they gonna do what they wanna do. They're going to fuck who they want to fuck. They're going to kick it with who they want to kick it with. They're going to flake on, stand up, and do all that sh other shit to the simps and suckers. And they're going to ride into the sunset and get pounded out and come back to you simps and suckers for support. Holla. Yeah.